Hey guys, uh, Retro Game 84 Gaming is on. Yeah. Today I will be showing you my uh, PlayStation games that I've got so far because I picked up a few like, a few months ago. I'm just going to show you all the games I have in my collection so far. Also, yeah, I'd like to give a few shout outs as well to the Retro Girls UK, Daniel Rich Gaming. Elite Gen Z, CUNY Gaming, definitely go check out those channels. I'm going to show you the first game on PlayStation, and that's Heart of Darkness. Really, really good game. And then, uh, there's Disc 1 and Disc 2. Next game, obviously, is a classic game on PlayStation and one of my favourite games as well in the series. And that's Resident Evil 2 on PlayStation. That's it. In the back. And there's the uh, booklet, and there's the this one and this two. And Another favourite game of mine that's in my collection that I've played before when I first had a PlayStation, and that's the uh, MDK. Pretty awesome game. It's a back. There's the manual and there's the disc. Another classic game that I played the demo of when it first before it came out on PlayStation. That's uh, Wild Nine. And it's done by Interplay, which is no longer around. Pretty good game. There's the manual and there's the disc. Next lot of games I'm going to show you in the PlayStation Collection. It's another classic game. The Mass 3D Realms. That's Duke Nukem. There's the back. And there's a manual and disc. Next is another classic game on the PlayStation. It's a really good game. I've had this one before, and that's uh, Chase the Express. There's the back, there's the manual, and there's this one and this two. Next, I'm going to show you another classic game on PlayStation that I got uh, both. Well, my brother bought this for me for my birthday in March. That's 007, Born Never Dies. There's the back. Sadly, no manual, but there's the disc. Next four games I'm going to show you, else yes, I need to get the first one on PlayStation. I'm going to start with you. Team Ready 2 on PlayStation. There's the back. There's manuals and there's the disc next is Tomb Raider 3 on PlayStation there's the back there's the manuals and there's the disc I'm going to show you the next two in a game in the series, and that's Tomb Raider The Lost Revelation on PlayStation. There's the back, there's the manual, and there's the disc. That last one on PlayStation in the Tomb Raider series, and that's Tomb Raider Chronicles in the Bell awesome game. It's also in Dreamcast. There's the back. 
is the manual and is the disc. A never classic game on the PlayStation. I'm gonna try and get the second one at some point, and that's Driver, classic game. There's the back of the case. There's the manual and there's the disc. Next is one of my favourite games on the PlayStation when I played this when PlayStation first came out, and that's Croc, Legend of the Gobos. Hopefully, I think they're doing a remake or something. I think on PS5, I'm not sure, but it'd be good if they did. There's the back. Uh, there's the manual, and there's the disc. Another classic PlayStation game, and hopefully, they're doing a remake of this or a remaster. And that's Legacy, Legacy of Cain. Sorry, either. Classic game. In the back. Here we have the manuals and the booklet. And there's the disc. Right, last lot of games in my collection on PlayStation before I go. Next one is Ridge Racer. Classic game. There's the back. Here we have the manual and the disc. That's another classic game on the PlayStation, and one of my favourite games as well. And that's Crash Bandicoot. The back. There's a manual and a disc. Another classic game on the PlayStation, one of my favourites. So I'm going to try and get the other one at some point. And that's obviously Alien Trilogy, also on the Saturn. There's the back. There's the booklet and the disc. And obviously this one I bought a while back as well and I'm going to try and get the first one on PlayStation and that's Reloaded, classic game. And then we have the disc and the manual. Well, these next lot of games I'm going to show you, I got these from a shop called Sawfums Retro Games in York. I got these pretty cheap and this one I used to have on PlayStation when I was like a kid and that's Tommy Mackin and Rally another classic game on PlayStation sadly no manual but still in good condition there's a disc this one is definitely one of my favourite games that I played on growing up as a kid and this is Tommy one there's the back. Sell the now front cover because they've got it a bit cheap. Also, there's the book and the disc. Another classic, another game that I picked up from the shop in New York. And that's C12 Final Resistance. There's the back. Obviously, this one has a manual. There's the manual and there's the disc. Last two games I'm going to show you now on PlayStation from a glass I used to have this game as well back in the day. And that's Hot Wheels Extreme Racing. There's the back. There we have the manual and there's the disc. Last game, I'm gonna sh show you. Obviously, I don't think I've played this game before on PlayStation, but it's supposed to be really good. A bit like Wipeout, and that's uh, Killer Loop. There's the back. There's the manual, and 
there's the disc so I hope you've enjoyed this video guys obviously let me know down in the comments what your favourite PlayStation game was growing up and lastly don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe and I'll catch you guys next time